Good evening, everybody. Welcome to beautiful downtown Westwood, California. I'm Peter Waldman. And I'm Tara Sands, and welcome to the world premiere of Hairspray. The highly anticipated summer blockbuster Hairspray brought to you here, 2007, opening July 20th. At a theater near you. So we're going to be bringing you all the interviews tonight. John Travolta, Michelle Pfeiffer, Queen, Queen Latifah. Latifah. So stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. We're going to bring you all of this live from the red carpet. Now, like John Travolta, you've made a name for yourself in the musical film genre. Is that something that you're going to kind of continue with, or do you think that uh, you're going to branch out and do other things? You know, it if musicals can come back, I, I would love to be a part of every single one. You know, these are such fun movies to make. It's not like a drama. It's not like your you know your your regular comedy. You are preparing by dancing and singing every day. It's a dream come true, man. It's a time of a, it's a, literally I'm having the time of my life over here. It's it's so much fun. So What's much the fun. most difficult part of that process? Is it the dancing, the singing, the acting? What is it? Yeah, you know, there's with, so many with aspects. With time, all of that comes. It's I think the hardest part of all of it was probably actually filming, remembering the lip sync, you know? <laughs> that, that was probably the hardest part. And now we're here with the star Amanda, Amanda Bynes. How do you do? Nice to see you. I love my space. Woo! I love the blonde. Thank You're you. rocking it out. Thank Last you. time I interviewed you, you were brunette. It was like a yes, year wait, ago. No, the, uh, Young Hollywood familiar. Awards. Okay, okay, I yes. I was dark. I, you know what? For hairspray, they uh, they made my hair a little bit lighter, and so then after it, I just put highlights in it. It turned blonde. It's hot. But I figured, you know what? I'm young, 21. I'll keep it for a little while, and, That's right. and maybe I'll buzz it off one day. No, I won't. You look like you had a lot of fun in this movie. I really <laughs> did. I had the time of my life. Like, I, I really wish that this movie never ended, although I'm glad it came out. But it's going to be sad when the movie is, like, out of theaters, but then it's on DVD. That's but right. but I really did. I had fun. It was like a, a musical summer camp. You just met Adam, and you see that he is so much fun. And every week we'd you know all hang out together and watch so you think you can dance, like all of the dancers and everyone and um, the cast. And it was a really fun set. It didn't feel like um, a sad, somber um, experience. It was everybody was like having fun, and John Travolta was in a dress, and it was it was a really fun experience. Well, how are you? How are you? That is the question. I am of the fabulous. Evening. I am so excited. We're in Hollywood premiering a movie that I'm in? Are you kidding? <laughs> you look fantastic. Thank you. Beautiful dress. Thank you so much. And even more so than that, a beautiful performance. We, we caught the movie yesterday. It's so fantastic. And uh, what was what was the hardest part about this film for you? I mean, this was your first movie that you did. Hardest part about the film, hands down, was leaving and going home and saying goodbye to your newfound friends. It was It was the experience of a lifetime, and I'll never forget it. You know, because I think somewhere, I mean, the, first of all, it's funny, there's good music in it, and I think that there's always something about people where they just, they're dying to be accepted for just being who they are, like not having to fit in with some status quo, and different is the hero in this movie. That's you right. look so different to me. I just saw the movie yesterday, and mm -hmm. I hardly recognize my you. My breasts and my butt are gone. Yeah. Do you miss it? Not really. <laughs> I heard it was rather heavy, is that it true? Was. Although I did like the admiration. I was flirted with a whole bunch. <laughs> Can you tell us what your initial reaction was when you were asked to play this role? Did you kind of scratch I, I your said, head? And... Why me? I said, I, honestly, I said, why? I mean, I've been playing macho leading men for 32 years. What was it about me that you, you feel I have to do this part? You know, what? so it took a year and like two months to decide if I was going to do it. But there I am. Great, and you Thanks. sound great. Was it, it was it fun for you to go back to the music? Uh, it was fun, movie? but I had forgotten how how much work it is. And mm -hmm. I, but I do that. I get very excited, and I sort of jump in, head first or feet first, I guess it is. And um, and I hadn't trained my voice in years. What a beautiful night it's been, and we want to thank all of you for joining us tonight. Thank you for watching on MySpace. Thank you very much, MySpace. Thank you, New Line Cinema, for Tara Sands. I'm Peter Waldman. We also want to thank Sebastian and their hair product. Ultra clutch when you know you're in a clutchy situation. When you need it. On behalf of Hollywood Premieres, I'm Peter Waldman, Tara Sands. You have a great night. Good night.